All right, folks, we're at the Samsung booth, CES 2020, and I am amazed. I had predicted earlier on YouTube that Samsung, when asked if they had any new SSDs, they would say, no, not this year. Well, I was wrong, guys. Here it is, 980 Pro, debuting at CES. Still no availability or pricing, but they are pushing Gen 4 PCIe to the limit. Sequential read writes of 6,500. 5,000. So 6,500 is just about the fastest we've seen. I did see small, the smaller competitor XPG advertising something over 7,000 in a pre-release product, but still 6,500. Of course, Samsung's using its own controller, which is one of the limitations of all the existing Gen 4 SSDs. So 980 Pro is jump, they're, they're jumping on board with it. This is a real product. So. Hey, sometimes you get it wrong, and I was wrong. I thought we would not see this product this year from Samsung. They're also showing their 90, 970 Evo Plus. So what this indicates to me is that they're not going to be replacing their mid-range drives. This, is, of course, is it's kind of a legacy drive at this point, um, and uh, it's it's going to be current for their mainstream PCIe. You know, it pretty much maxed out the Gen 3 speed. So. 980 Pro is the next one up, guys. It's coming, we just don't know when, we don't know how much it's gonna cost, but I would guess uh, probably 300 for their one terabyte and probably 600. Oh, sorry, they're not gonna be offering a two terabyte. That is gonna be an issue. It's gonna be an issue right there. I'm very, very surprised they're starting at 250 gigabytes, which makes no sense on a drive that fast. They must have some technical limitation about that. Okay, so, I'm glad I caught that before I walked away. That is gonna be a major, stumbling block for Samsung if that's gonna be their biggest drive on the 980 Pro this year. So we'll see. If you have any questions, post them down below. If you like the video, please do like and subscribe and I will catch you next time.